Welcome, new recruit, to the children. We exist to serve the glorious swarm and to purge the world of heretics and unenlightened. These are our commandments for our human members of the swarm. One. You may not talk about your meaningless lives before joining the children, unless it is deemed useful by a sentinel. 2. The sentinels are to be obeyed. They are to be given what they request on the threat of merging. You can identify them by the image of a member of our glorious swarm branded onto their cheek. 3. All relics of the world before the coming of the swarm are to be presented to a sentinel who shall decide if it needs to be destroyed or if it still has a use in our mission. 4. All those not yet enlightened in the ways of the swarm are to be given the choice. All those who refuse are to be merged. If you don't give the choice, you must present your reasoning to your sentinel. If they find it insufficient, you will be merged. 5. Exceptions can be made if they are young and female. While still heretics, their wombs can be used for the expansion of our army. 6. If any shall break these rules, they are to be lashed to an extent decided by their sentinel in severe circumstances they are to be merged 6a redemption is possible those who are willing are to spill their sacred blood and draw the swarm to heretics settlements if the swarm allows them to keep their form, they are to be allowed to rejoin. If the swarm chooses to merge with them, they are to be honored in death. These repentant are to be given blades to ease their merging. Seven. All our members and heretics are to be merged with the swarm. However, for traitors and the worst heretics, they are to be merged while breath is still in their form. A. One of the worst examples of heretics are those from the zones. Bastards are the reason so many weren't able to experience the swarm's glory. All oppressors of the zones are to be merged. Our glory shall be endless and eternal. Soon all will either join us or merge with the swarm 